Hi friends, I hope you had a great weekend with your family and that you got to enjoy uh, some activities whether indoor or outdoor. I hope you got a chance to also get to, ch uh, to check out Tumble Book Library. Uh, last time we read a book about Can Hands Give Milk with Miss Huynh. So I hope you enjoyed that website and had a chance to explore it. Now guess what? This week, some of you guys are going to be celebrating a small holiday and it's called Single de Mayo on Tuesday. So, um, in uh, the spirit of Single de Mayo, Miss Wynn has a special book and it's a nonfiction actually that I like to share with you about um, traditional food that people in Mexico like to eat when they celebrate. Uh, this special holiday so it could be this dish or another one but this one is a book that I would like to introduce to you and it's actually on a different website it's completely free you do not need password or any other access to log in all you need to do is have your parents type in www.uniteforliteracy.com once you get to this site, you will see it looks like this. Okay, and the first book that we're going to read is called Cooking with Moms. I click on that. Oops, there we go. So you can see this book, you can read along with me, or you can just listen for now. And if you see the little uh, volume button right here, if you read at home, you can also click on it and follow along and it will read it out to you, okay? So let's start with the first page. Cooking with Mom. Cooking with Mom by Kenna Kuna and Grace Dennis. Okay. Today we are cooking quesadillas with my mom. We are so excited. First, we cut the vegetable. I like to put peppers in my quesadilla. To be safe, I curl my fingers like a bear claw to keep the vegetables from slipping while I use the knife. Next, we shred cheese for the inside of our quesadillas. Once all of our all of our ingredients are ready. It's time to make quesadillas. First, we put the tortilla down. Then, we add cheese and vegetables. Finally, we fold the tortilla in half. Then mom turns on the skillet to heat. We love watching the cheese melt and become gooey. Once the quesadillas are ready, I eat them with my mom. Sometimes we eat our quesadillas with guacamole and salsa. Mm -mm -mm. We love cooking with our mom. The end. So I know this is a very short book. Um, we don't get a lot of stories in here because this is a nonfiction. Now, if you are interested, there, is, there are two questions that I have for you. One is, think about a story or the book that you just read and think about this question. What are you cooking this week with your mom in the kitchen? If you can help her, tell her, Mom, what can I help you this week? And she can give you some small tasks to help her, okay? If you get a chance to help your mom in the kitchen cooking, then you can write a how-to book to show friends how to make a dish that you helped. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this book and you can always check out more books on Unite for Literacy. Have a great day and enjoy the rest of the week, okay?